Hello ladies and gentlemen, today we have for you third place bout in the uh, Pancras 1996 Neo Blood Tournament Keichiro Yamamiya versus Osami Shibuya and this is just a little bit unfair on old Kei considering he was just TKO'd by uh, what's his face, Yuki Kondo uh, A couple of outside low kicks, nice palm strike from Kei Yamamiya He's doing alright, uh, a couple of palm strikes, nice double leg on uh, yeah, on Osami there, which is a bit of a surprise, because Osami was one of the better wrestlers in Pancras. Uh, Osami's trying to work that half butterfly guard, trying to work an elevator hook. Body punches from Kei. He's really trying for that elevator hook, but he's abandoned it. Back to clothes guard has Osami Shibuya. And the refs decided to stand straight up, which is interesting. Lots of uh, artifacting on those camera angle changes. Hard low kick, another double, in on a single, ah, nice switch by Osami Shibuya, very nice there, uh, wrestling pass, he's gone to a low single, Kei's spun around, uh, I wouldn't have done that, I would have kept pushing down on Osami's head, uh, now he's trying to spin to the back, Osami is faded back to half guard, oh well, what do I know, it's worked out better for Kei than I thought it would have. And yeah, in the thumbnail for this video, I spelt Keichiro wrong. There are two I's in Keichiro. Well, three I's. It's K, K E I, Ichiro. I C H I R O. Rather than just Keichiro. K E I. Yep. Whatever. Well, uh, deep half sweep attempt by Sami Shibuya there, but the cross face from Kei was stopping it. Uh, over to mount goes Kei, but Osami caught him up in half guard when he tried to step to side. Uh, he's trying to walk his hand, his foot up and push down the knee, peeling on Osami's toes, and they've been stood up. Palm strikes, single leg attempt, a uh, good whizzer and crossface from Osami stopped that. Ooh, hard knee and a snap down by Osami, but Kei's backed out up to, uh, back up to his feet. Lead palm strike. Walking knee strike by Osami, straight into a single leg from Kei, and Kei has finished that into top half guard. Body punch. I'm gonna stand up again. That one makes more sense, considering that Osami's head was under the ropes. Little uh, sort of mincy slaps from Osami Shibuya. Hard knee from Kei. Uh, Sami's tried for a double wrist lock and rolled through on a knee bar attempt and he's caught a toe hold. Uh, Kei's managed to kick free out of that. Sami's switching to a knee bar and he's going to switch back to a toe hold it seems. Yeah, he got a toe hold. Uh, he's abandoned that. Uh, passed it across to the other side. Looking for a heel, I think. Oh, I can't be looking for a heel because those are super forbidden. Uh, just trying to set up a set up a lock of some variety. <laughs> Not really securing the hip of uh, Yamamiya there. If he'd have done that, he might have been able to finish one of those holds. Another single leg attempt. Another nice switch by Osami Shibuya. That is a lovely uh, technique. Uh, Kei managed to back out of it, and he's managed to finish the single leg. But he is in the double wrist lock, which Osami has given up on. I really like wrestling switches, or passes there, as they are sometimes known. I'm not super up-to-date on my wrestling terminology, because I've never done it uh, uh, officially as a, uh, as a martial art in itself. I have, of course, stolen wrestling techniques and uh, applied them myself. But, uh, yeah, I'm not super up-to-date on what's a funk and what's a pass and what's a... Well, I know what a pin is. Uh, I can tell you what a spadle is. But otherwise, yeah, I'm in a bit of trouble. Alright, refs told him to keep fighting. Ooh, lead hand slap from Osami Shibuya. Given that Kei is half concussed, I would have, oh yeah, would hit him a bit more than Osami is now. Maybe Osami's being nice. Uh, oh, leg scissors, rolling knee bar attempt from Osami Shibuya. Kei is doing alright, uh, keeping his weight on that foot. Oh, no. Osami's managed to pull it up. He's got the leg straight. He's pushing it down, trying for a toe hold. Kei is doing a good job of fighting hands, but Osami's got the, uh, Got the hip secure, and he's managed to force down the toes. 
and he's connecting his figure four and he's put the toe in the butthole and that is the escape there. Uh, the reason that one worked better than the other ones was because Asami actually secured Kei's hip by uh, triangling his legs on the outside. That is, uh, in modern grappling parlance, that is, I believe, outside Sankaku, which is literally translated, well, it's, uh, it's, it's Japan English? I don't know. Uh, yeah. In weeb speak, it is uh, an outside triangle. Alright, overhook. Tries for the overhook throw. He was thinking about rolling through that leg again. Uh, good knee from K in there on the clinch. K had a very nice clinch, I remember that. Uh, I remember that, considering I've watched most of his career. Uh, Osami pulls guard. Very surprising. But he's uh, kicking across, feeding himself under for the toe hole, as you can tell by the grip he's got there. Uh, using the bus route and sort of... And, uh... Yeah, the non-connected toe hold, where you uh, pull, push on the toes and pull on the heel. Uh, not officially a heel hook, but it's pretty much a heel hook. But a good technique, especially in shoes, which are a little bit easier to grab than feet. Good little fight, this. Um, Asami's doing a good job at... Asami is a lot more exciting when he's being taken down than when he's taking other people down. Because uh, when he gets top control, he's just a bit too happy to ride. Uh, whereas, oh, good knee by Kei. That one uh, bothered Asami. But Asami's grabbed a single and gone around the back. And so Kei, rather than having his back taken, has given up bottom half guard. Uh, well, bottom guard, but Asami's finished a pass into half guard. Uh, he, the way his foot's up, I think he's going to attack a toehold, and also he's reaching back to screw around the, with the feet. Yep, uh, Asami kicks his other leg across, straight into outside, well this is just outside Ashi, uh, which means outside leg, um, and he's got that toehold. And Kay has made an unhappy noise, and has lost third place in the 1996 Neo Blood Tournament. And I hope you all enjoyed that, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time.